In no preferential order, ENTV bring you a list of Nigeria's richest bachelors and what makes them thick. For the ladies, this is one adventure you wouldn't want to miss. Audio jungle. Popularly known as Suji Moto, 34-year-old Suji Bomi Ogundele, a real estates merchant is here enlisted as one of Nigeria's richest bachelors that ladies can die for, considering the strength of his bank account. Siji is the CEO of Suji Moto, a real estate business empire. He was reportedly featured in Forbes Africa as a brave young entrepreneur, an astute businessman with the capacity to change the Nigerian real estate industry. Siji who boasts of a vast degree of experience as a venture capitalist and investment strategist has provided a solid background in ensuring Suji Moto achieves its mission in the establishment of classy housing units in Nigeria that can compete in the global market. Extremely articulate, Siji's undying love for fast cars and antique watches, as well as the luxurious lifestyle is next to none. At 33, he bought a pricey Paytech Philip wristwatch that costs $150,000, million naira, and when asked, he said he procured it so his grandson can one day use it. The young man with a very humble beginning in age is responsible for the popular Medici terraces at Milverton Road, Ekoi. The buildings are architectural masterpieces capable of dropping jaws. Bashir El Rufay is the son of Kaduna State Governor, Malam Nasir Ahmed El Rufay. Often described as a wild young man who enjoys life to the fullest. He never fails to make out time for his friends, go on dates with his long list woman, buys expensive gadgets and wristwatches and even goes gaga at clubs especially when with his friends. Bashir recently declared he is now worth N90 billion with 40 mansions in assets according to media reports. With virtually all the good thing of life dangling around his waist, several ladies must be dying to have him. Theo Danjima, son of retired General Theophilus Danjima who was a former Nigerian defense minister and the founder South Atlantic Petroleum. Theo's father's fortune is estimated at $700 million from oil to shipping and real estate. Later on the family has become famous for collection art objects, a course which Theo is currently championing. He is building up and showcasing his art collection which has over 400 works at the moment. Jide is the first son of the Globacom chairman, Mike Atnuga. Jide who walked out of his father's wealth in a bid to chase his own, runs a multi-million Naira beverage conglomerate. His company, 3 Inclusive LTD is the exclusive importer of Monta Udon Champagne as well as Very Very and Chiraz wines. 3 Inclusive Limited, according to reports, is also involved in the importation of newsprint for newspaper organizations. With a flourishing multi-million Naira empire, Jide who can be called a self-made man is one bachelor whom an average single lady will go to any length to have as her husband. Hotels.ng CEO, Mark Sen, is one of the few successful Nigerian startup founders with a technical background. His portal, Hotels.ng, is rated, Nigeria's largest hotel booking website. It allows users from all over the world to book rooms from a selection of over 6,000 hotels. The company has so far raised more than $250,000 in funding from Spark Fund among other investors. Not much of his personal life is open to the public, but many believe the 31-year-old software developer is still single and searching. If you were a single wouldn't you want to be his wife? Audio Jump